This segment is sponsored by the Richmond Ballet. Richmond Ballet is delighted to bring Shakespeare's Romeo and Juliet to the stage. Sabrina Holland, ballerina with Richmond Ballet, joins us to share more about this spectacular performance. It's great to see you, Sabrina. Hi, good morning. Thank you so much for having me. Absolutely, our pleasure. This is a classic story, one certainly that Shakespeare very well known. What is it like bringing this to the stage and what can audiences expect from Richmond Ballet's production? Yeah, it's such a special production for us to put together and bring to the Richmond community. Um, and it's a classic story, you know, so many people uh, know it and have studied it in school. Um, and through the ballet production, I think, even though there's no words, because it's all done through dance and through movement, um, but it's very clear to follow the story and the music guides you through each character. And um, it's a really wonderful production and it's full. Sabrina, you play the role of Juliet. Talk us through what it takes to prepare for something like this. And I'm noticing that beautiful costume, the dress behind you. Is this a piece from the show? What is it like wearing, frankly, so much costume to dance in? Yeah, this is um, part of one of the costumes that I'll wear in the production. And, you know, the role of Juliet, she has so many layers. You know, she's a 13-year-old girl to begin with but she goes through so much in such a short amount of time in the play it's about three days but in the ballet it's just two hours so it takes a lot of preparing um as a character and being able to go from this young girl who then falls in love and then ultimately takes her own life in such a short amount of time so being able to create that story for yourself and the audience to um really clearly follow uh, it's really special and takes a lot of background and being able to research her and how you want to portray that. Um, and then, of course, the aspect of all the costuming and being able to wear this. We're used to wearing multiple different costumes, doing other roles throughout the time. So it's just a fun addition to it. Sabrina, you have the opportunity, you've been with Richmond Ballet for about 10 years, you shared. You have the opportunity to work with friends and colleagues. Let's talk a little bit about the cast size and what it means bringing everybody together for this production. Yeah, it's, um, it's a large cast and we get to include members of our um, School of Richmond Ballet is also part of the production. And then we have uh, characters like Lord and Lady Capulet who get to come in and the Friar. So it it brings in all different elements and people to make it happen, um, which is really special. And eventually everyone will learn their roles individually. And then we bring everyone together to put together the production. And um, those are always really exciting times for us because you get to see what everyone else has been working on and how we can all come together to create this really beautiful ballet. Sabrina, it's so important to share this with audiences. You know, we're, we're two years almost uh, into this new scenario, and folks are so hungry to be able to come out and enjoy productions in person, just like Richmond Ballet's Shakespeare, Romeo and Juliet. Talk us through what it looks like to come and enjoy this production. What are the protocols in place? Yeah, um, we also are so happy to be in person. This is of course, really lucky to be back on the Dominion Arts Center stage. Um, and to come, they do require either proof of vaccination or a negative test that has been done within 72 hours. Um, but if you're under the age of 12, you're asked to just have your mask on. Everyone is included to, in the mask wearing, but it's for the underneath, under 12, you would just have to wear a mask. Well, Sabrina, we're so excited that this is all coming together. We're going to share information so everybody knows how to get tickets. Thanks so much for making time to talk with us. Thank you so much. We really appreciate having us here. Absolutely. The Richmond Ballet presents Romeo and Juliet, February 18th through the 20th at Dominion Energy Center. For all the information, call the Richmond Ballet box office, 804-344-0906, extension 224, or visit the website, richmondballet.com. Connect on social media at Richmond Ballet. Please stay with us, Virginia. This morning, we'll dance right back after this break.